Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Um, I'm not sure whether any have joined this month actually but if you have you're obviously welcome here. Um, my name's Jo and I mainly do regular choice um, handbags and shoes but I do do other brands like I'm doing today. Um, and for those of you that have watched for a billion years, thank you so much for continuing to watch my videos. I very much appreciate you taking the time to do that. And for those of you that are just watching the videos, I'd really appreciate if you subscribed because I would really love you to join our happy, merry band. Um, so what I've got for you today, I've got a handbag, a pair of shoes from a different brand and I do have a pair of IC as well. So what's been happening? Um, it's been work, work, working really. But last weekend I went to see the Barbie movie, you know, everyone's going to see the Barbie movie. Um, I enjoyed it, it was good, um, a bit preachy but um, generally good. Um, there was a lot of very little children there in tutus and that it, it's probably not for, for those children and um, so I think they got a bit bored. Um, older children would see it on some level and probably enjoy it um, but there's a lot of adult humour that maybe go over their head but they, you know a bit like a pantomime you know that there's two layers um, so but I did enjoy it today we're going to see the behemoth um, Oppenheimer I think the film's on for about three hours um, but Killian Murphy's in it so oh, hey ho even if I just get to look at him for three hours it'd be good so yeah that's our plan this afternoon um, we're going off to see Oppenheimer um, I'm now starting the countdown to my holiday I think it's uh, just under five weeks <laughs> tick 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 the days off till I get back to my beloved Turkey um, hopefully it'll cool, cool down a bit from what it's been just recently um, I mean I still want it to be hot like but um, not so intense um, as they've been having. Anyway, <clears throat> let's dive on in. So the first thing I'll show you is the bag. Um, this is the dust bag that they come in. Um, design is what we do, kindness is what we are. So this is the brand Kurt Geiger. I've got a few Kurt Geiger bags. Um, and I think like a pound or something goes from most purchases to their um, charity thing. I think they aim to raise about a million pound a year and they use it to support young people, I think, um, you know, getting into jobs. So, you know, good. At least they're trying to do something. Um, so this was in the sale. And it had gone from, I think it was like either 239 or 249 down to £89, which was a massive saving. Um, it's all made out of like crochet. Um, this is the back of the bag. So you've got like this blue. What's not coming across is there is like a metallic thread. You can see it there, but it like really twinkles Um in real life whereas you can see it there the flex of the metallic but it's not like twinkling as in real life and you've got this orange panel here at the side you've got this pink and again you've got this flex of metallic um big hole where the chain comes out and look at the front so first of all this is the signature of uh, um the eagle head of uh, Kurt Geiger and this is quite a big eagle head and it's got all the crystals on it and the crystal eyes um, but this is all like fruit so you've got the lime here and you've got beads um, I mean I don't know whether they're lemons because they're awfully small if they're lemons if that's the lime 
but anyway you've got these and they've got beads on them and you've got the orange I can maybe see the twinkle of the beads here um, and you've got the leaves maybe they got a bit squashed in the bag um, the leaves and they've got beads on them and um, I'm thinking this might be watermelon you've got like little beads here and again these lemons berries I don't know and you've got the lemon slice here I just think it's so lovely um, and this gold is gorgeous it's oh it's just beautiful it's actually quite a big bag as well you know if you look at that under my arm it's quite a, a hefty bag um now i do prefer as you all know um a top handle um um it's this absolute yellowy gold interior there's no pockets it's just an empty hole um you've got a plaque on the back that says inspired by our city we believe in self-expression authenticity and distinctive design for the individual who wants to channel their true self and then the design is what we do kindness is what we are and um, that's on the the back now the chain that comes with it if you want a long chain this is not the bag for you um but this is what sold it to me because as i say i'm a top handle girl now this is enough for you to carry it over your shoulder and no more it's comfortable there and i like that they do the leather strap here that sits on your shoulder because sometimes if it's full chain it can you know be a bit jaggy on your shoulder um but it's short enough i can put it over the crook of my arm as well um but as i say if you want cross body it's definitely not that um but i just think that bag is absolutely stunning absolutely stunning really summery fruity fresh absolutely gorgeous um and as i say just this gold chain short handle perfect love it and metallic closures that more or less shut themselves so it's quite good um yeah i'm really really pleased with that sale bargain absolutely love it so which side am i going to now the next shoe i'm going to show you is it's a brand done by a singer and the singer is Katy Perry. Now, if you know um, Katy Perry, she is known for a very out there outfits. Um, you know, she'll have outfits that look like ice cream sundaes and, you know, she's really out there. So she's done a range of shoes and they're really reasonable. I mean, you can pick them up on vintage at 20, 30 pounds. You know, they're not dear. Um, but I just saw this heel and I just thought it was quite fun. Um, and although my main collection will always be a regular choice, sometimes, you know, if I see an, an unusual heel, I'll think, oh, yeah, that'd be fun to add into my collection. Um, so from the front, they're completely and utterly boring. It's just this green... Um, I mean, I don't even know if it's leather or not. It feels like leather um no idea anyway <laughs> could be leather might not be leather um but it's just this green and i quite like green um but it's the heel the heel is a cactus this little flower on so um obviously nothing on the soles because um it's a katy perry shoe not a regular choice and they have these long 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 um, ties and at the end of each tie if I can get to the end of them you've got away, these little little flowers which um, kind of match the the flower on the cactus 
Um, so, but they are really long, so I'll probably have to wrap them round a few times, tie them. Um, but yeah, I just saw them, and as I say, they were really, really cheap. Um, but I just thought they'd be interesting to add in my collection. And you can see it's got Katy Perry on the inside. Um, but maybe if you're liking unusual heels, go and check them out. She does some really crazy ones. Um, so, you know, I might add some more of hers in, in the future. Um, cause she does one that's like a, a tequila bottle. And like, you know, you have the worm in the tequila bottle. There's like a worm inside it. <laughs> you know, crazy. Um, but yeah, I just thought I'd show you them. And then maybe you can check that brand out and see if there's anything you like. So, what have I got for your irregular choice? <clears throat> well, I mean, you know, sometimes things just pop up. Um, and this these popped up. I've got quite a few Muppet shoes. Um, most recently I got the high heel piggy ones. But, you know, I've got the ones with Kermit and uh, Miss Piggy on. And, you know, so I do have quite a few of those shoes. And I've got bags. Um, but I'd always wanted these other ones, um, just because I really liked this character when um, when he was on the Muppet show. Um, and I mean, some people love the Muppets and some people don't, but I was kind of brought up with the Muppets, um, you know, and used to watch them all the time. And so for me, there is a definite nostalgia there for the Muppets. And I mean, I even like the Muppet films, they, they still make me laugh. So um I think I have water. I think if um if you like them you like them. So these are bright yellow. I mean almost going on to the neon yellow. And they've got a blue glittery heel. Um quite a low heel, even though it's pointy, it's still very low, and you've got a star on there, and you've got a star on here and that'll give you the clue even though it's back to front um you have all the muppets on the inside which you can see there and it says gonzo and here he is in there uh, all his glory so you've got sequins making his face and you've got these little beads for his eyes um i just think that's fantastic and then you've got these three little, um, the light cut out, and then you've got the glitter. Um, but fantastic. And Gonzo looks amazing, embroidered mouth, embroidered eyes. And then you've got his little thing there. I just think they're fantastic and really comfy, really comfy. Um, the other shoe, same but different. Um, and that has probably should have shown you this one first. Um, it has the great on that one, so together the great Gonzo, and that's in red. I quite like that when they do it different. So I've got a red star on one shoe and a blue star on the other shoe. Um, and again, Gonzo at the side, and you've got blue stars going up this one, so kind of opposite to the other shoe, which um. Again, I like that. It's uh, it just adds a d another dimension. And on the bottom, there you've got Gonzo flying in the sky. <laughs> Super Gonzo um, on the bottom of the shoes. And I just think they're a fabulous find. And they'll be great in my collection. Um, I'll definitely wear them to work, actually, because they'll be dead comfy at work. Um, I was just waiting to... To show them on here so um i'll probably wear them this week um for work and enjoy them so what have i got for you next week well i picked up a pair of boots that are normally about 200 pounds i've seen them go for more than that and i got them for Sixty pounds, including the postage, and they're really spectacular icy boots. So I can't wait to show you them. 
I've actually got another um, Kurt Geiger bag to show you as well that I've got in the sale. Um, might be on the theme actually when you see it. So yeah, um, we'll, we've got those to look forward to. And I'll be two weeks closer to my holiday as well. Woohoo! Um, I shouldn't wish my life away. Um, anyway, it's been lovely to show you these things this week stay irregular guys don't follow the crowd because it's so boring and i'll see you next time bye guys <laughs>